the, the development of the offense so far in spring? I know it's early, but how do you feel like things are going so far? I feel like uh, things are going real good. You know, we're just picking up what we left, left you know, a couple months ago, and I think that we, we catch it along, bring the new guys along really fast, and once we get that done, then we just keep on clicking. What's it like being a, being a veteran, old guy on the offense now? Yeah, it's, it, it's, it's, um, you know, it's a blessing you know, to even make it this far. You know, a lot of people don't even get this chance. But, you know, being a vet, you know, I've I seen a lot, been through a lot. You know, coaches change three and nine seasons. And next season, you know, I'm going to national championship. You know, so it's, you know, it's just a blessing, though, just to get to see a, um, a lot of different things in life and a lifetime experience. What's the competition out there across the board at receiver? You know, having a couple of new numbers come in, do the same. Um, you know, you know, it's always competition, but we, you know, we bring them in as a brotherhood, and we gon' we gonna bring them guys along, you know, and make sure they know what they gotta do so they can get on the field just as fast, just to help us, because both of them guys definitely gonna help us get back to what we're trying to look for. What's your first impression of you? Um, you know, he, he's um. He's a guy, that, a competitor, definitely. You know, you know, he hates to lose. I've seen that, like, you know, because I, he was my, um, I was his host, you know, as he was on the recruiting visit, and you know, just talking to him, just knowing what type of guy he is, and just seeing the, how much stuff he just got built up inside of him, just to let it all go on the field, just to be the number one guy coming out of JUCO, you know, and I, I see that he's a baller. We hear uh, he likes to talk on the field. What do you kind of uh, see from him as far as? That aspect, that bravado. Um, you know, as the people say, if you talk on the field, you got to back it up. And I'm sure I'm definitely seeing that he's doing just both of those. You know? How much the, the difference in Nick? What have, what have you seen out of him this spring? Um, I'm seeing, uh, I'm seeing uh, an NFL caliber quarterback right now already, just in the spring. You know, making throws that he wasn't making in the spring last year. Right now, you know, just leading us. You know, and, and just being that guy, you know, that we can lean on. And, he can lean on us, and he made a bad throw. We just got to catch him. You know, make him look better. I'm gonna put from a leadership standpoint. You know, just his his personality. How much has that changed in one year? Um, it changed a lot, you know, because you know everybody. He knowing everybody, and we knowing him right now. And it just he he to the point now where everything is clicking. He knowing the offense, so it's not that many buzz. You know, he throwing the ball where it's supposed to, making the right reads. And I think um, Coach Gus and um, Coach Lash is doing a good job right now. Where is, it looks like DeQuell is, is working, Duke is mm -hmm. working uh, behind Sammy, I guess, at that, that boundary or whatever, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it, it, is that a position where he might work with the first team, or what do you see in there? Yeah, I mean, you know, the way our offense set up, you know, who will be in and on what type of play, you know. So I think, you know, both of them guys, for him being behind Sammy, going to make Sammy work even harder. And both, that's just going to make both of them become a great player, you know. So it, it's great that he did come in. Coach Craig told us before he came in that he was going to help us, you know, be great and, and see that he was really doing it right now. How is uh, Jeremy Johnson coming along to some degree? Gus Mounds was talking quite a bit about trying to get him better. Oh, I think he's doing a lot better, you know, because Jeremy was a really, you know, the type of running quarterback type as far as me. But I think he's coming along real good, you know, just being in his offense already for a year, you know. He's not getting that many reps in the game, but still at practice, he's getting tons of reps. So he, he's coming along real good in the zone league right now. How, is, how exciting is it for you guys as wide receivers knowing that, you know, Coach Mazan, Coach Lashley are talking about throwing the ball more and you're seeing it in the spring already? Um, it's, 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 you know, it's, it's, it's great because, you know, we know we come to practice every day and we're trying to work, you know, just so we can give him the confidence to just know if we're trying to go deep, you know, we just got to make the plays because Coach got Malzahn, he's like, if, if we don't do it at practice, then it's not going to be called in the game. So we just got to make plays at practice and then it'll carry over to the season. You mentioned that Nick making some throws that he wasn't making last. Is it a specific type of throw, just more deep balls? What? Yeah, I mean, the deep ball, you know, we probably missed a couple of deep balls last year. I mean, he put them on the money, you know, on the short routes, you know, he put them where it's supposed to be. And, and, it, and once he do that, it's just going to make everything else come along. Sammy obviously emerged as kind of a go-to threat. As important as the other playmakers, the other receivers, to, to step up in, in your game and be that guy where maybe it's, the offense isn't so one-dimensional? Right, definitely. Um, I think Sammy, Sammy no he's the go-to guy right now. I, mean, I think everybody in the world knows that. You know, but you know, he's going to open it up for everybody else. And then once, once he opens it up, we're going we to open back up for him. And he's going to be unstoppable right now. Definitely.
Thank you.